Hello everyone, welcome to my Black Friday 2015 Blu-ray haul video. I hope everyone had a happy Thanksgiving the other day. And in this video I have 23 Blu-rays to show you here, as well as a game that I got. And I got them all at Best Buy, Target, and Walmart, and two of them came from Big Lots. So here's what I have. I'll start off with the ones I got at Best Buy. First is Inside Out. I got it for $9.99 at Best Buy. Heard really, really great things about Inside Out. Uh, the film features the voices of Amy Poehler, Phyllis Smith, Bill Hader, and Louis Black, among others. And like I said, I've been wanting to see Inside Out for a while. If anyone has seen it, let me know what you thought of it. Okay, next. It is San Andreas 3D. And I got this for $9.99 at Best Buy. And the only reason why this was, this was $9.99 is because it comes with an exclusive collectible mini poster. And, you know. And I, are, I know that I already have the Target exclusive steelbook of this, but a 3D movie for $10 was just too good to pass up. But anyway, that's San Andreas 3D. Okay, next is The Hobbit, The Battle of the Five Armies, the theatrical version. And I got this for $5.99 at Best Buy. I was originally going to get the Five Armies extended edition but there was no steel book for this and I was very disappointed that they didn't do a steel book for this like Best Buy and Target did for the first two. So until they get their act together and do an extended edition steel book for Battle of the Five Armies, I'll just have to let this uh, theatrical version suffice for the time being. But anyway, that's The Hobbit, The Battle of the Five Armies. And I got it with this really, really nice looking slip cover here. Okay, the next three are TV shows, four ninety nine each. First is Hannibal season one, and I've heard really, really great things about the show. And the series stars Mads Mikkelsen as Hannibal Lecter, Hugh Dancy as Will Graham, and Lawrence Fishburne as Jack Crawford. But yeah, really, really looking forward to watching Hannibal. I only wish they had season two for four ninety nine, but oh well, maybe it'll go on sale one day. Okay, and the next two are Orange Is the New Black seasons one and two, and I got these for four ninety nine each at Best Buy as well. And what more can I say about the show? Really, really funny here. Really funny. I haven't watched season three yet. But uh, anyway, that's Orange is the New Black. Okay, and these next three Blu-rays are $5.99 each as well. Okay, first is Wild Card. Uh, the film is directed by Simon West and, and it stars Jason Statham, Michael Angarano, Ann Hesch, Sofia Vergara. Jason Alexander with Hope Davis and Stanley Tucci. And as some of you may know, this is a remake of the 1986 Burt Reynolds movie Heat. So I'm looking forward to, to seeing this one. I, I love Jason Statham in, in any film he's in. Okay, next is Last Night. Five ninety nine at Best Buy, and the film stars Clive Owen and Morgan Freeman. And if anyone has seen Last Night, let me know what you th what you thought of it. Okay, and the last one from Best Buy is Vice, uh, starring Thomas Jane, Bruce Willis, and Amber Childers. And if anyone has seen Vice, let me know what you th what you think of it. Okay, these next five are from Target. 
first is the Lego Movie, the special special edition. And this was $6 at Target. And I already have the Lego Movie 3D in my collection. However, I'm looking forward to checking out this new special special edition with the bonus disc with over two hours of all new extras on here. But anyway, that's the Lego Movie, the special special edition. $6 at Target. Okay, next is Pitch Perfect 2 and this was $10 at Target and this is the Target exclusive with 30 minutes of behind the scenes and more and the film is directed by Elizabeth Banks who also stars in the film and the film stars Anna Kendrick, Rebel Wilson and Haley Steinfeld and uh, this is a blind buy for me if anyone has seen it let me know what you thought of it Okay, next is Terminator 3, Rise of the Machines. Uh, this was $4 at Target. And, um, you know, I just got this so I can complete my Terminator collection. Uh, the only one I don't have is Salvation. Uh, but I don't, I'm, I'm in no rush to get that one at, right now. But anyway, that's Terminator 3, Rise of the Machines. Okay, next is The Fault in Our Stars, $4 at Target, uh, starring Shailene Woodley, Ansel Elgort, Laura Dern, and Willem Dafoe. And I rented this a while back. I thought it was pretty good. And granted, uh, the end, uh, granted, the ending was pretty sad, to say the least, but this was still a pretty good movie, you know. And for $4, why not, you know. I originally wanted to get the the Little Infinities edition, which comes, which comes with an unrated cut of the film. But for four dollars, you know, I, I was willing to make the sacrifice here. Okay, and the last one from Target is Mad Men: The Final Season Part Two, and this was eight dollars at Target. So now my Mad Men collection is officially complete. Okay, next up, I'm going to go ahead and show you the two that I got from Big Lots. Uh, these were $2.88 a piece. First is Martha Marcy May Marlene. And the film stars Elizabeth Olsen and John Hawks. And this is a blind buy for me. So if anyone has seen Martha Marcy May Marlene, let me know what you thought of it. Like I said, this was only $2.88 at Big Lots. Okay, and the other one that I got for two eighty eight is the double feature of Hollow Man and Hollow Man Two, and I originally had this a while back. Uh, I, I sold it, so so you know this was this is me uh, re adding it to the collection here. Okay, and these last few are from Walmart. It, including the game that I got from Walmart as well. I'll show you that one first. That's Grand Theft Auto 5 for the PlayStation 4. And I got this for $25, which I thought was a really, really good deal here. I wasn't willing to pay $60 for it. So looking forward to playing this on, on my PS4. Okay, and now on to the Blu-rays. First is Spy, and this was $9.96 at Walmart. And the film is directed by Paul Feig and stars Melissa McCarthy, Jason Statham, Rose Byrne, and Jude Law. It includes both the theatrical and the unrated cuts of the film. And this was a blind buy for me, so if anyone has seen Spy, let me know what you thought of it. Yeah, I. I'm not a real big Melissa McCarthy fan, although I think she is pretty funny. But like I said, you know, Jason Statham is in it. And as I said earlier, I love Jason Statham in any in any film he's in. So I'm looking forward to seeing him flex his comedy chops in the film. Okay, next is Run All Night. 
and this was six ninety six at Walmart. Uh, comes with the the slip cover as you can see. And the film is from the director of Unknown and Nonstop. It stars Liam Neeson, Ed Harris, Joel Kinnaman, Vincent D'Onofrio, and Common. And I saw this in the theaters a while back, and I thought it was a really good thriller here. Granted, it's not Liam Neeson's best film that he's done, but it's far from being the worst that, he, that he's ever done. But anyway, that's Run All Night. Okay, next is The Mummy Real Heroes Steelbook. And this was six ninety six. And uh Yeah, uh so yeah, Steelbook for six dollars was you know was this was a good deal right here. But uh yeah, that's the mummy steelbook. Okay, the next two are triple features. First is the the Blade triple feature with Blade, Blade 2, and Blade Trinity. And this was $6.96 at Walmart. And I missed I missed getting this last year. So so once I once I seen this, once I saw this on the shippers, I wasn't willing to I wasn't willing to make that mistake again. And um to be honest, to be honest, Blade 2 is the best film of of all three films, uh, the first Blade, um, you know, I liked it when when I first saw it, but looking back on it now, you know, looking back on it now, it's my second favorite compared to Part Two, and we we all know how bad Blade Trinity is, but you know, still need to complete the collection now, but still, I would have easily gotten Blade Two by itself here, but anyway, that's the Blade trilogy. And, uh, you know, Wesley Snipes and Chris Christopherson star in all three films. Okay, next is the Matrix triple feature with Matrix, Matrix Reloaded, and Matrix Revolutions. And this was also six ninety six as well. You know, what, what more can I say about these three movies? I mean, six ninety six was just too good to pass up here. Okay, and the last two are are from the three ninety six selection at Walmart. First is Machete Kills, and this was three ninety six at Walmart. And I saw this on Netflix a while back, and I I I really enjoyed it. Uh, was it was it better than the first one? Um, kind of, sort of. I I enjoyed it. Uh better than the first one even though the first one had uh Robert De Niro and Steven Seagal also starring in the film as well. But anyway, that's Machete Kills. Okay, and the last one from Walmart is Mud. Got it for 3.96. I had Mud before, but I I sold it, so now this is me uh re-adding it to my collection. Brilliant film here. Uh, McConaughey gives a really good performance here so what more can I say about it okay so to recap what I got I got Inside Out San Andreas 3D The Hobbit The Battle of the Five Armies Hannibal Season 1 Orange is the New Black Seasons 1 and 2 Wild Card Last Nights Vice The Lego Movie The Special Special Edition Pitch Perfect 2 Terminator 3 Rise of the Machines the Fault in Our Stars, Mad Men The Final Season Part 2, Grand Theft Auto 5 for the PS4, Spy, Run All Night, The Mummy Steelbook, The Blade Triple Feature, The Matrix Triple Feature, Machete Kills, Mud, Martha Marcy May Marlene, and The Hollow Man Double Feature. Okay everyone, this has been my Black Friday 2015 Blu-ray haul. And you know the drill. Rate, comment, subscribe. And that will do it for today. Thank you for watching. Bye.